What do you wish you knew when you started your software factory transformation journey and cybersecurity? What do you wish you knew when you first started? Yeah, so the I guess the biggest thing is, um, you know, technical debt is is really hard to uh, to address. You know, we're we we are finding it so much easier to integrate new ideas and new capabilities into systems that we built from the ground up. Um, you know, to to operate in this kind of continuous integration, to continuous delivery environment. Um, you know, partly that's because architecture really matters. Uh, you know, systems that are architected so that you can change small pieces of them without having to to change and therefore test the whole thing again. Um, that you know that that it can't understate the importance of that, overstate the importance of that. And and then, um, you know, part of it is just because when we when we try to apply security controls after, um, you know, we're you just find that there are things that would have been so much easier to correct along the way. And all of a sudden you're, you're left with a mountain, right? And then, and then you have to do the, and you know, there, are, there are definitely still approaches. Our legacy systems, you know, we're, we're doing what we, what we should be doing. We're taking the most important stuff first. We're, we're, we're you know, going in that direction. We're triaging, we're starting with the, the, the highest hitters. But, uh, but, you know, in a lot of cases, you know, we, we just, we wish, you know, maybe if we backed off a little bit and just said, you know what, as we start to offer these CI/CD pipelines to programs, um, let's let's take an extra couple of weeks before we get you going. Let's make sure you have a fully established pipeline. Make sure it includes everything that you that you are going to need later on, even though you've only written a few lines of code. I think, you know, there, in in a lot of cases, I think we we we'd like to to have that that a little bit over again to go back and do that. We've put a lot of effort since then. Uh, into having that kind of you know ready to go, ready to drop into a project pipeline, so we can go from zero to you know a, a full pipeline with test and security scan in like 20 minutes now, and that's that's great because it means that new programs they start out with that. Um, but you know we are definitely still correcting for some early cases where we didn't always do that. 